Hello everyone, I am Dr. Ayushri, your pain, musculoskeletal medicine and rehabilitation specialist. Today we are going to talk about scoliosis. So scoliosis means that your spine isn't straight. There can be an S-shaped or a C-shaped curve. Now when we look at the x-ray, this curve is not normal. And how do we decide how severe it is by measuring the Cobb's angle? So we measure the Cobb's angle at the highest point of the tilt. Where spine sabse zyada tilted hoti hai, pe we measure the Cobb's angle. And usually if it is more than 20 degrees, it is considered a severe grade. Now this, this, this uh, curve will start affecting the other parts of the joints of the MSK going forward as we age. So there will be discordance in the sc uh, scapular region. The shoulders will be uneven. Aapke kandhe jo honge, uneven uh, shape ke honge. There will be compensatory, ish, uh, compensatory changes in the other parts of the joint like SI joint in your pelvis, you know, the sacroiliac joint. So the pelvis will be tilted. There can be compensatory changes in the knees, uh, in the ankle. So the body will start compensating. There will be changes in the one part of the rib where there is more angle. You know, over time, there can be the case where uh, one part of the lung is not getting the proper space to expand and grow. So there will be breathing problems uh, going ahead in such cases. So it is very important for us to understand, see that there is a problem and report early before we achieve the skeletal maturity. Because once we achieve the skeletal maturity, correcting the curve without the surgery becomes very difficult. Now, before the skeletal maturity is achieved, we can actually work towards uh, this problem with multifaceted and multidimensional approach to control this uh, increasing growth of the curve and rather correct it without any surgery needed. Now, in such, in this particular case, we had to work in multiple dimensions because there was scapular discordance was there. There was nerve impingement at multiple levels, which was giving multiple so much pain to this kid you know there was hip pain as well because there was uh, arthritic changes and compensatory changes in the SI joint so we did plan some interventions usually the interventions in such cases should only be done by a very experienced interventionist because you know there are multiple congenital problems like uh, but uh, you know wedge vertebra butterfly vertebra das tetometomyelia and so all such problems are there so it has to be very uh, experienced uh, physiatrist who is intervening in such cases. We did place some blocks to increase, to reduce the inflammation and uh, nerve compression so as to ease out the problem. We did uh, GFC uh, to you know increase the muscle strength because usually there is uh, you know over utilization of one part of the body and the weakness in the other part uh, because of the discordance. So we did uh, use growth factors to help the patient with the you know, muscular uh, issues. And then we started uh, with a comprehensive rehabilitation protocols like, you know, prescribing her the right kind of brace, which was customized. So usually Boston brace is what is prescribed, which you have to wear for at least 23 hours out of 24 hours. Matlab ki 24 ghante mein se 30 ghanta is brace ko pehenna hota hai. Apart from it, a customized physiotherapy schedule was planned for her. Pulmonary rehab is a very important component as we can see that the curve is compressing the lung on one side and usually it is it, it is happening in the growing years. So the, you know, the lung being compressed on the side will be less, uh, you know, it will expand less. There will be restriction in the, in the growth. So pulmonary rehab is very important. You know, breathing exercises, breathing techniques and lung expansion exercises are very important. Uh, so a multifaceted approach, a multifaceted uh, rehabilitation is very important. And the most important part of it is that we identify this problem and we bring the child before the skeletal maturity is achieved. And uh, so that we work uh, on all the aspects because body is a system. And then to compensate this curve, body will, it will uh, start affecting multiple uh, areas of the body and there will be multi system involvement, multiple joints involved to compensate and uh, will result into more deformity and uh, more problems for the uh, patients. Hence, uh, it is very important that we consult the right, uh, right doctor at the right time. And I wish all of you to have a healthy and a happy life and uh, just take care of your spines. They require most of your attention.